today we're going to make a burger, but not the burger you're thinking of. Today's burger is going to leave McDonald's in the shadows. We're going to make my version of a Mexican burger. Welcome back with the Drunken Barbecue, my friends. Today we're going to make a Mexican burger. I'm sure through the video you're going to think, what the heck is there so Mexican about this burger? Well, all the ingredients we're using, you will find back in the salsa. Well, salsa has Mexican in it. And my friends, we're going to cook today again on the shovel. Nothing Mexican is made without spices, so let's make our wrap. This thing to blend is nothing more than the equal amounts of onion powder, garlic powder, chili flakes, black pepper and some paprika powder. And this thing to blend of awesome flavors we simply mix together. Now we have our thing to blend ready, the fire is going, it's time to prep our meat. Yes, we're using a flank steak for a burger. Mexicans like this steak done over a wood fire, so up again, so do we. First we're going to put some oil on both sides, so our rub sticks. And then we take our rub and sprinkle it on both sides of the steak. And there we go, let the shovel party begin. We're going to heat up the shovel, give it some oil and throw on the meat. And there we go, if that isn't a nice flat fire bit, I don't know what it is. Oil! Isn't this fantastic, my friends? Time to rock and roll! There we go! Ha <laughs> ha! Music! Life is good! Well, there we go! Ta da! And I would say this is going pretty good! Cheers, my friends! Before you guys start filling me in box or leaving lots of comments below, at the end of the video I will show you how I prep the shovel. Well, I think the meat is done. I should get myself a thermometer now. And off goes the steak. Then we give it some more oil. And on goes the pepper. Would you believe that? I'm prepping vegetables. <laughs> so I declare this done, so off they come. And no burger is complete without a toasted bun. So we're gonna do that as well, but we don't need all the oil for that. Fire! Bread toast very fast, so don't walk away or scratch your prairie oysters. Okie dokie, that's it. Time to assemble the burger. And there we go, time to assemble the burger. Yes, I'm in the shade, apologies for that. It's 20 degrees Celsius, guys. I'm not used to that yet. And there we go. First things first, a little bit of mayo. And then we get ourselves some lettuce, that looks good, but it also keeps most of the moisture away from the bun, so it stays nice and crunchy. Like I thought about it. Then we take in our meat, and we're going to put some cheese on it. Real Mexican cheese, from Superstore. I know what you're thinking, cheese needs to be melted, and that's what we're going to do. <laughs> Isn't this fantastic guys? Look at it! Look at it! No problem! And when you do this on a plastic cutting board like I do, just watch out where you go with your flame, right? And now you see why we have two cutting boards, because we need some tomato. And there we go, 
I said to me do. And then we're going to put some pepper on it. Those lovely ones we just roasted. And there we go. A lovely yellow and a red one. Oh, this starts to look like a tower of goodness already. And you know what they're saying, right? Some onions a day keep the doctor away. So we're going to put that on there as well. And life would be pretty horrible without pickled peppers. So there we go. Put some of these on. And last but not least, the cilantro. Why cilantro? Well, the salsa can had a picture of it on it. There we go. Lovely. Doesn't that look healthy? And now, my friends, this tower of goodness needs a hat. And now, of course, the big question is, what will it be like? <laughs> well, let's not wait any longer then. And there we go. Oh, ho, ho. Ladies and gentlemen, Viva la Mexico! <laughs> you see that? Hey, medium rare. Who's the boss now? Well, there we go. Time to inhale this baby. There we go. Mmm. Mmm. No, all those juice. Mmm. Good, I'm wearing an apron. Apron. Mmm. Fantastic. Well, this is definitely not a one bite meal. Mm. Sorry, you don't work. <laughs> Here you go, guys. It's time to show you how to prep the shovel. First, we're going to take a burner and burn off all the paint. And with flames, guys, size matters. When all the paint is burned off, we're going to take a wire brush and brush all the remaining bits off till you're down to bare metal. And here you go, a nice clean shovel. We're gonna take some oil and really soak in the shovel so it doesn't rust anymore. And that's it, that's all there is to it. And no burger is complete without a toasted bun. So we're gonna do that as well, but we don't need all the oil for that. Ooh. Fire! Ah! Fucking smoke. I expected a little bit more flames. <laughs> but never mind. Here we go. And there you have it, my friends. Doesn't that look fantastic and an awesome way of making a burger? Well, before you step away, check out the next video. Thanks for watching. Hit those like and subscribe buttons and see you next week.